What's going on guys? It's Tony from Lomo Paintball and today we are talking the brand new HK Army Ether 3 Hive Tournament Package. And why? Because it's the best source for tournament packages and everything paintball related. That would be LoneWolfPaintball.com. So today we've got, um, obviously as this video is being shot, it is the brand new released all metal uh, Ether 3 HK Army body. If you guys can see, it's called the Hive. If you take a look at that bad boy, the milling. The milling alone will let you know what's good with this. But before we jump into that, we're gonna start with options and what it, this package is gonna come with. So first off, um, you've got an option to either choose an HK Army Sonic Loader or the HK Army TFX3. So a little bit about both of these hoppers, I can tell you, um, completely speed feed compatible. The TFX3 does come with one. So on, the, on that three, you've got an option for a uh, speed feed, rain lid also included, expansion ring included for this one too but I'm gonna show you on the Sonic, that's not the option. You just get a rain lid, but you guys can definitely buy a speed feed for this bad boy and uh, keep it rocking if that's the route you guys wanna go. Um, completely toolless to take apart. So Sonic loader, and while I'm getting this sucker apart here, take a look on the inside. You don't need any Allen wrenches or screwdrivers to do that to you know access batteries or do any maintenance. It does come with a back spring ramp inside of the Sonic loader. And then you can just take that tray out to access, you know, get to the batteries and all that good stuff. Once again, completely toolless. Both of these hoppers uh, feed 22 plus balls per second. Uh, capacity on this one should be right around 200 rounds. So holding 200 paintballs inside on the Sonic loader. As for the TFX3 though, you got a standard capacity of 180 paintballs for this bad boy. It does come with the expansion ring included in the box. So if you guys wanna put on the expansion ring right here, uh, you can raise the capacity up to 230 balls inside of the hopper. Uh, like I said before, this one does come speed feed, rain lid already included. Uh, it is a lithium ion battery, which uh, does need to be fully charged before you guys play. Uh, this one is also completely toolless. And this one comes with a front spring ramp. So as you guys get low on paint, it's gonna feed that paint down into the drive cone and uh, help you, you know, obviously with a better rate of fire for the marker. And it's got tension control, tons of good stuff on the flip side of this. But we've done full videos on this hopper before. So if you guys wanna check a full breakdown of the actual hopper itself, uh, go check that out. We've done full breakdowns on the TFX3 already. And just to be clear, guys, you're getting to pick one or the other Correct. depending on the price point. Not coming with both. Is... Uh, price point, so for the, with the Sonic loader and your HSTL tank, um, 975, obviously you get the gun tank hopper of your choice, but if you chose to upgrade to the TFX3, you're talking 1050, so 1050. Um, so we'll set that off to the side. Uh, next thing you're gonna need other than a hopper is going to be a tank, your air system. So you got the hostile 684500 uh, tank here. It's gonna be standard output pressure of 800 PSI. And obviously the internal regulator on your marker will crank that down to whatever operating pressure it needs to be at but this is the HK Army Hostel tank, just your standard reg, obviously gauge on this bad boy to let you know how much air you have left before you, you look dumb and run out on the field. So you don't, you don't want that. But yeah, just your standard 6845 uh, carbon fiber wrapped tank. Very, very nice. Onto the prize, onto the prize of the show. It's the HK Army Ether 3, the Hive Edition, all metal body. So six different colors available on the website. Um, we'll start kind of from the top and go down. Once again, if you guys want to know anything about the actual Ether 3, I have a full breakdown and shooting video uh, already on the YouTube page. And I also have, uh, we've done efficiency and we've done how to program it too. So other than the new all metal body and this beautiful milling on here, it's your standard Ether 3. You've got a two piece uh, shaft five barrel, 14 and a half inches, uh, quick auto cocker threaded. You've got the release system here for your battery. You can simply pull that out. It's gonna be a nine volt that's gonna power this. It sits right up in the front grip. So that is completely toolless. So I do like that. It's a very, very nice option to have. Slide that, lock that back in. You've got eyes, you got laser eyes. Uh, you've got a low uh, rise clamping aluminum feed neck with a thumb wheel. So depending on whatever hopper you guys are choosing, you guys can tighten or loosen that down to your specific needs with the nice thumb wheel that it has. Uh, nice rake style blade trigger here. Uh, most important for me is going to be the uh, Gamma Core. It's uh, great for efficiency. It's great for the brittle tournament paint. So simple up and out to do any bolt maintenance on this bad boy. So this is the Gamma Core that is included with the Ether 3. And then down below, 
Uh, you do have a POPS ASA. So down here, when you guys are engaging and disengaging the air, you've got your nice POPS ASA. And this thing is fully programmable. It's fully electronic, obviously. Like I said, if you guys pick one of these up and you need to know how to program, I already have a video on that. So a uh, quick little video on the HK Army Ether 3 Hive package. You know, you got the hostile tank and then your choice of either a sonic loader or the TFX3. Mark, do you need to know anything else, my man? Since it's a standard Ether, uh, yeah. just with the HK milling and whatnot, it's still capable to be upgraded with all the other aftermarket. Like if I want a different trigger later on, if yes. I want to do... All the other upgrades for this, yeah, the only thing different on here is the, the beautiful HK milling and the all metal body. Um, so yeah, if you guys want to use or upgrade it to any of the other stuff that Ether 3 has, this will also work with this one as well. Perfect. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, you guys don't forget, this is the most important part, shoplomblepaintball.com. See ya.